Today in Universe Sandbox, we're gonna be terraforming Jupiter, the first gas giant of the series. So let's do it. Okay, here we go. It's Jupiter here. Jupiter is the biggest planet in the solar system and you guys wanted to see it terraformed. So let's just go over the rules. We're not allowed to change any of Jupiter's properties in here, but we are allowed to change the atmosphere because there's no other way to change that. So how we terraform it is with these tools in here. If we open up Jupiter's composition, we can see that it's not all hydrogen. 2% of it is silicate. So I wanna add a little bit more silicate to it so we can go into tools and material and then go to silicate let's open up jupiter while we're doing this so we can see what's happening so get it a good amount of silicate and then also some iron okay perfect so now that we got a good core in here we can actually use the laser and try to melt away all of the hydrogen uh, if we get if it gets hot enough, the hydrogen will start to melt off. There we go. So this is starting to work. A little bit of hydrogen is coming off. Double that. And there we go. So 0% hydrogen now. It did burn off the rest of the silicate, but that's okay because we still have iron. So let's actually go back to material and let's just increase the mass on this until it's back to one Jupiter because we're going to need um, on all of our gas giants that we terraform, we're gonna need their masses to be the same so their moons stay in orbit. Okay, perfect. So it's 60% silicate now and 40% iron. And we got a the mass now is 1.03 Jupiters, which should be fine. If we need to, we can adjust that, but that should be good. Okay, so now we got our planet. It's a rocky planet now and the size is good. So let's cool it down with the cold laser again. So now we're going to want to add some water, I think, or let's do an atmosphere first. You might want to do like 10 Earth's atmosphere. So this would be almost impossible to live on as a human, but a different kind of life could develop on here because the pressure is going to be 26 times Earth's pressure. Okay, let's add some water. Get all that in there and then we can settle the water, which is just like if we sped up time um, to have it all settle. Uh, this looks like the coastline is wigging out well let's go into planet scaping and try to draw so let's just remove all the land so then we can draw our own continents in okay now for the north pole start to get a north pole on jupiter here add some ice up here and we'll do one for the south pole too Okay, now we need to start drawing the continents. I'm not sure why it's glitching out like this. A lot of times objects that aren't like designed to do what we're doing with them. Like when I terraformed the sun on a live stream, it was glitching out so bad when I was trying to do stuff like this on it. Okay. Um, I like our little continents we got here and then the most we'll just leave ocean, but we have these islands too. So the majority of life will happen on these two continents and they are connected, which is perfect. Um, it is a little bit cold on here, so let's fix our atmosphere. Some more atmosphere layers. Okay, so it looks like we got to a point where it's slowly heating up. Um, so my, that might be a little bit too much. It's staying pretty solid here now, so we'll leave it like that. And now we're going to change some of the visuals. The atmosphere already looks pretty nice. This land, I don't even know if we can make it stop glitching out like that. Let's add city lights. So you can see there's some city lights now and vegetation. So it looks like the vegetation's only gonna go on the edges. So let's make that like sort of yellowish. And then for the elevation color, let's do like more yellow. I wanna give it like some orange land. Something like that, I think. Um, let's add a little bit more coverage with these clouds. Okay, I think I like that. So now if we open our system that has all of our terraformed planets, we can go to Jupiter and replace it with our new one. So we can replace object. Okay, so here's our new terraformed Jupiter. Let's name it Better Jupiter. And let's see how the moons react. It looks like they're doing okay because the mass is very similar. Okay, that's perfect. So here's our final Jupiter and our 
life likelihood is 4.7, which I mean, that's not a lot, but it's so big. There is a chance of life. So we were successful in terraforming it because before Jupiter, there's no chance of life at all. Thank you so much for watching. Join my Discord server. The link's in the description and leave a like on this video and I'll see you guys next time.